let they know. Never been able to protect anyone. You to proceed in good faith. <laughs> Thought you could snuff me out. You don't know me at all, miss. for the world.
General Washington, I'm fine. You, on the other hand... Hello, Sarah. Goodbye, Sarah. Well done. Hey, come on, man. They freed me. Looks like this will be your last Christmas. Very well. There's no reason both of you have to die tonight. <coughs> Whoa, okay. okay. Now, where is the fragment of the spear that I had you protect? You got this. This is my ship. Only will do as I command. It all still fits. It really is rather difficult to put weight on when you're a film student. So, you remember? Everything. I really am very sorry, Sarah. It wasn't you. This is you. Try, Mr. Jackson. You need to understand that this is one problem that cannot be solved with violence. Okay, maybe a spot of violence. Gideon, fire! Fire everything! Oh, isn't that adorable? making it unstable. When it reaches critical mass, it will consume Mollus. And rip. Gideon, time jump us out of here. She can't. Rip has our time drive. Yes, but there is another one. On the jump ship. Wally. Gideon, put me through to Rip. Rip. I'm a little busy at the moment, Sarah. Look, you didn't tell us that you were buying us time with your life. Listen carefully. This gambit will not kill Malice. We'll only delay him long enough for you to make an escape. There has to be another way. No, there isn't. It's all right, Sarah. I should very much like to see my wife and son again. I will miss you, Captain Lance. You and the rest of the legends. My one hope is that you all live up to that name. Captain Lance, the time drive is reaching critical mass. Can we jump? Mr. Mars has finished making repairs. We have 15 seconds. Goodbye. Goodbye, Captain. Gideon, get us out of here. Ironic, isn't it? 
A time demon who's run out of time. Yeah.